Scoliosis is a condition in which the spine is not straight and it's curved in the coronal plane, meaning when you look straight on at the person, there is an abnormal curvature of the spine instead of being straight up and down. In an adult, there are two types of scoliosis. One is adult idiopathic scoliosis, which is basically untreated scoliosis as an adolescent. And the patient has grown up with the scoliosis and still has the scoliosis as an adult. The second type of scoliosis is adult degenerative scoliosis. These are patients who did not have scoliosis as children, but as they got older, usually between 50 and 70, they began to have abnormal curvature of their spine. As an adult with scoliosis, just because you have scoliosis does not necessarily mean it needs to be treated. Many times patients with scoliosis don't even know they have scoliosis and it's asymptomatic. The indication to treat the scoliosis is if it causes symptoms. So there are patients who have scoliosis, but they don't need actual treatment because they have no symptoms. There are patients who will have symptoms from scoliosis, however, and this can manifest as either back pain or leg pain or difficulty with walking and standing. In those patients, the scoliosis may be shifting to the point where it pinches the nerves. In those patients, if the symptoms are bad enough, treatment is a very reasonable option. The three mainstays are physical therapy, medication, and injections. Generally, patients only do surgery if their quality of life is unacceptable to them. Columbia Neurosurgery in Oxpine is one of the world-class centers for scoliosis. We can treat scoliosis patients with extensive non-operative care from physical therapy to pain management, and we have experts in non-operative care for scoliosis, including physical therapy and other modalities that do not involve surgery. However, if a patient ultimately comes to surgery because of their disability and because of pain, we have world-class surgeons who can treat scoliosis in both traditional open manner and a minimally invasive manner. We have experience in the entire breadth and depth of the treatment of scoliosis at Columbia Neurosurgery at Oxbine.